guys, I'm Danica with Coupon Yet It's Finest, and I'm bringing to you today my Walgreens and CVS Coupon Haul, and today is Saturday, um, April the 15th. Um, I apologize, I'm not back on a hiatus, um, I haven't been able to upload, um, but I have been very active in my Facebook group, so uh, just to let you guys know, if you guys would like to follow me further, I'm on all social media, um, and I'll put a link in the description box to my Facebook group, um, all of them are the same name, Couponing at its Finest, um, so I've been just a little bit more active on Facebook lately um, and not YouTube or TikTok. So um, with that said, I do have actually two hauls. I have um, one for Walgreens and I have one for CVS. For Walgreens, I did three transactions and also for CVS, I did three transactions and clearance alert for you guys. Um, now today is the last day of this sales week. A new uh, sale will start for tomorrow. So if you guys have not gone out and shopped um, as of today, you can catch these deals. But um, the paper products, that, that's a month long deal. So you have until April 30th um, to go out and catch that. Okay, now let's go ahead and get started. Um, for the first transaction, um, it was just a mini deal. And I'll show you these boosters in just a second. But um, I did uh, do the um, Oral-B deal. And for this week, it is when you buy three, you will get back a $5 register reward. Now, this one, I had a hiccup. Um, the first ones I picked up, um, they did not attach to the coupon, which was the new ones, the Oral-B Brilliance. So I had to put those back. Um, and I got the regular um, Oral-B Radiant. This one's been out for quite a while. Um, and these are going to be $5 this week. Once again, when you buy three, you will get back a $5 register reward. So, for three of them, that's going to be $15. So, I did use the $5 off three digital coupon. Now, I don't believe that coupon is expired. So, if this deal, which it usually does, roll over into next week, then you can go ahead and use that coupon. But, it does apply for this week's sale. So, my total out of pocket for the first transaction was $10. And I did get back um, the $5 register reward. Okay, now for the second transaction, I opted to do the Tide Simply. Now, this one isn't a deal directly. It's more of just a good sale. Now, the Tide Simply are going to be 3 for $8, and it is on the Tide Simply Liquid and the Tide Simply Pods, 13 count. Now, I just did those by themselves. I did use a 50 cents off one Tide Simply Pods Digital, and I used a 50 cents off one Tide Simply um, Liquid Detergent Digital. And then I did use the $5 register reward from the first transaction. If you guys are unsure or new to Walgreens shopping, yes, you can use com uh, manufactured coupons, whether digital or paper version, in combination with a register reward, as long as you are using item to coupon ratio, meaning all of your items that are in the transaction do not have some form of manufactured coupon applied to them or attached to them so in my um playlist on my youtube channel i do have an advanced walgreens shopping i have a few of them in my um coupon tutorial playlist so you guys can hop on over there and um find out more information on how to use register rewards and wax cash and boosters um and manufacture coupons digital and paper version on the products in your transaction to make it work correctly whereas one one form of coupon per item purchased. So with that said, these are three for eight. I used both of those 50 cents off one digital coupons and the $5 off of uh, the $5 registry reward from the first transaction. So that brought my total down to $2 out of pocket. I did not get anything back. Like I said, this was just a good sale. It, it wasn't a registry reward or wax cash deal. So I did end up doing a third transaction. Now at first it was just the Scott products. It was the Scott um, six count paper towel that you see right there. Those are gonna be regular shelf price, $5. And the Scott 12 pack big rolls, once again, regular shelf price, $5. Now we do have a $1.25 off IVC in store value coupon that is a store coupon that does apply to both of those. And then we also have a $1 off one Scott paper towel and a $1 off one Scott toilet paper digital that we can use um, together. We can stack those together. So I had that at first, but 
this is the clearance that I found. <laughs> so be on the lookout for these in your um, Walgreens location. The four pack of Walgreens brand, four double roll equals nine regular roll, um, super premium, ultra quilted paper towel. This one specifically um, was marked for me a dollar and 59 cents. So I do have a total of three of them. The one up here is sitting on the one in the back. Um, just so that you guys can see it. But I do have a total of three of these. Once again, on clearance for $1.59. And always remember that whenever you guys see clearance on Facebook or any other social media, it is YMMV that does stand for your mileage may vary. You may find this or you may not. So just be on the lookout for this. Now, that all that together was in my last transaction. I did use those two manufactured digital coupons for the paper towel for the Scott and for the toilet paper for the Scott and the $1.25 off IVC did apply to both of those. So I don't have a receipt or anything to show you guys for that one, but um, I accidentally sent it to uh, my email. <laughs> I wanted it digital, but whatever. So I think my total out of pocket was $11 for that last transaction, but I am so happy. I did not clear the shelf. I was very tempted to for that price, but I did not clear the shelf for the paper towel. I only got the three. It was five on the shelf. I left two. So that's fine. Someone else can go ahead and catch that. So that's everything I did for Walgreens for today. Now let's go ahead and go over to CVS. Okay. Also, um, before I show you CVS, I did forget um, to show you guys the boosters I got uh, for today from Walgreens. I got um, one for $5 back when you spend $15. And then I got two of them, um, one from each of the last two transactions for 20% off your next purchase of $10 or more. And then don't forget, these cannot be used on sale priced items, nor can they be used if you find that paper towel. They cannot be used on um, clearance because clearance is considered a sale. So um, they do have to be used on regular prices. Now for CBS, once again, I did three transactions. Now for the first transaction, um, I did the deal for this week. Uh, when you buy three Crest or Oral-B uh, products, you will get back a $5 ECB. Um, I did it uh, twice in one transaction. As I told you, told you guys in previous videos, if you do have um, additional limits that you can do the deal, usually oral care is two times, you can combine them in one transaction and you'll get back a lump sum ECB or um, two separate ECBs for uh, that deal. So the Crest, these are gonna be $3.99 and I got three of the Crest 3D White Charcoal and I got um, three of the Crest Complete Plus Scope because um, this is the last day of this week's sale cycle. So um, it was pretty slim pickings. I wanted, I did not want toothpaste. You guys know that. I wanted the Oral-B, but they were, um, when I tell you that shelf was clear, it looked like they were putting up a new planet gram it was so clean <laughs> you could just take the pics and walk off from where they uh once were where the products once were but anyway so i opted to go ahead and do the toothpaste just to complete the deal anyway so with buying six of them at three dollars and 99 cents that brought my total to 23 dollars and 94 cents and then i used um a five dollar off of three um oral care um digital it was a list of coupon it was oral b the mouthwash and the toothbrushes and the crest toothpaste so be on the lookout for that it is not expired in your digital account so i used that and then i used the two dollar off one crest toothpaste um digital coupon i bought six products so that covered four of them okay and then i used a, my ten dollar care pass and then i used my five dollar pharmacy and that brought my total down to $1.94 out of pocket. And then I got back a $10 ECB because um, I did it once again two times in one transaction. Okay, now for my second transaction, I did the spring deal. And that deal is um, it's a multitude of products. When you spend $25, you will get back an $8 ECB. So I wasn't too keen on that one. Whenever they drop the ECB amount from 10 to something else, um, I try not to do that deal, but circumstances being, I got too low on my laundry detergent, so I did it anyway. <laughs> 
So um, I opted to get uh, two of the Tide Whip Downy. That's the big one, the 92 fluid ounce ones. Those are going to be on sale for $12.99. Now, I got two of the liquid because they were out of the Tide Pods, the big one, um, for $12.99. Because there's digital coupons on both, which would have lowered my out-of-pocket further. But, circumstances being, I went ahead and did that. Um, I could have got a rain check, but, I mean, it's not that big of a deal because I need the laundry detergent now. <laughs> so, here is my receipts. Uh, so, for both of those, they brought my total to $25.98. And then I used the $10 ECB that I got from the um, toothpaste, the Crest transaction. And then I used my 2% back in extra bucks that's always listed in your digital account. I had 80 cents. And then I used, um, now, I had loaded the $3 um, Tide Pod and the $3 Tide Liquid. N now you can see why my total would have been lower if they had the pods. But. For, and this has occurred before. I know it has happened to you guys who are veteran walk, um, veteran CVS shoppers, wrong store, <laughs> um, when they pull coupons. So they pulled my $3 Tide from my account. So with that said, my um, manager went ahead and just override it and took $3 off for me, which is the equivalent value. So that was fine. So they brought my total to $12.18 out of pocket before tax. And then I did get back my $8 ECB. Okay, for the last transaction, now that one I had to improvise a little bit on the fly in the store. Um, my aim was to get four of the all. Those are going to be on sale this week. Um, it's the all and the snuggle products. Um, buy one, get one free. And the one that you purchase is going to be regular shelf price. So that price may vary depending on what region you're in. And then the total home um, liquid laundry detergent was just on sale for $4.99. That's the last all my store had. And I really didn't want the snuggle right now. I don't need fabric. I needed the laundry. So I was a little bummed I didn't get my other three all. So the manager went ahead and just uh, override it and gave me the last one that they had in the store for half off. Um, so do not go to your store expecting for your manager to do that. That was just a courtesy that my manager um, decided to do so with that said um, for two of those my total was eight dollars and 98 cents and you can see it right here the total home four dollars and 99 cents and then the override you see the M right here manager override to three dollars and 99 cents for that all liquid laundry detergent okay so that brought my total to eight dollars and 98 cents I used the $8 ECB that I got from the Tide deal. So that brought my total down to just 98 cents out of pocket. And that deal was not giving anything back um, at all. It was just a really good sale. And like I said, I'm my purpose was to get laundry detergent. So between the two stores, I think that's four, five, six, seven. I got seven out of the nine I was supposed to have. So I still think that that was really, really good. And then my crest here, I'm keeping these and taking three others out of my stockpile. And then these three and the three other ones are gonna go uh, straight to donation. I don't need these. And then I'm keeping my toothbrushes and my tie simply from Walgreens. <laughs> and of course, I'm keeping all of my paper products. So yeah. <laughs> Okay, guys, that's going to go ahead and wrap it up for me. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and happy couponing with love. Bye.